A lot of anger tonight from Inkster residents fed up with footing the bill for the city's legal problems. And what's even more frustrating, city leaders say this is the only way they can stay afloat. 7 Action News reporter Jane Park is live in Inkster tonight where dozens of residents were hoping to get an open ear, Jane. They were, Glenda. You know, this all stems from hefty settlements on lawsuits filed against the city. And because Inkster can't afford them, the people have to pay with their property taxes as state law allows. But with so many people facing their own hard times, they say this seems like insult to injury. The frustration was palpable as nearly 100 people peppered Inkster City Treasurer about their higher summer tax bills to cover the city's legal costs. People can lose their houses over this mm -hmm. if this thing continues to roll like that. Residents will have to foot almost $1.5 million in court settlements. A huge chunk of that will be paid out to Floyd Dent, the man who sued the city after former police officer Bill Melendez was caught on video beating him. We don't have any money to pay him. Because the city of Inkster is broke, the bill falls on taxpayers, almost 40% of whom live below the poverty line. You know, you can't put it on the people. You can't drag the people. You can't drain the people any further than where they are now. Oh, none of this is fair to the people. But city treasurer Mark Stuhldreyer says there's simply no other way because Inkster's financial problems run so deep. The stressed city has survived the past several years by cutting jobs and expenses, and now residents say they're literally paying out of their pockets to keep it running. Frustration. Large amounts of frustration. Helplessness. They're not looking out for us. And they're left wondering how long they can put up with it. We didn't get into this situation in a year or two. It's going to take us longer than a year or two to get out of it. The uh, city treasurer did tell residents today the city's financial health does look better now than it did several years ago. Live in Inkster, Jane Park, 7 Action News.